It was halfway through February, and already we had a new batch of residents on the island. First up, there was a Yoshi. I'm Yoshi. I'm actually more serious than my smiles let on. <laughs> really? That's a first. What's up? Did you know that pandas have really great eyesight? Next up was a North American bison. I'm bison. I'm very particular about going by the book. Yeah? What's up? It's the middle of the month already and I've hardly done a thing. Hmm. Haven't we all, bison? And at number three, we had a wolf. I hate wolf. I don't listen to opinions. I have my own. It's an interesting mindset. What's up? It's still dark when I wake up. <laughs> it could be taken many different ways. News of the new residents spread quickly. Hey, penguin. Hello, and welcome to the afternoon edition of Mini News. There has been an increase recently in stray wolf sightings around homes in the area. Oh? The wolf is cute when it's young and is a popular pet. However, as they grow, they become more rude and eventually fight with their owners before finally leaving home. Oh no. Give a stray wolf food and it will pester you for more. So if you see one, just try to ignore it. What? We asked some islanders their opinions. Why didn't you tell me this sooner? I don't want to be on TV. I wasn't doing anything bad. Jeez. Thanks for watching. Wolf's not that bad. This was your midday news report. Once again, Frog was trying to get his best friend Boris the Wolf into a relationship. This time, he paired him up with Horse. I have fun. Let's go out again sometime. Mm-hmm. Oh! This time, he succeeded. But he wasn't the only one to succeed, as Mouse planned on having a baby too. I've been thinking about having a child with Shark. <laughs> go for it. Doesn't it? Yep. Hopefully this one isn't too ugly. But she wasn't the only one about to enjoy the joys of parenthood, as Pink Panther announced he was going to have a child too. While later on, I tried getting Homer to get Wendy off my back. I was like a regular coffee, but you made my life creamy. Please go out with me. I'm sorry. Dang it. Not today, Homer. The number of residents I was getting recently was getting out of hand. A walrus had arrived on the island. A walrus, that's it. Hmm. Yes, I know you've been on another island from another series before, but hey, you were also in my me channel before that series, so... Yeah, that says something. What's on your mind? People say I always look annoyed. It's just my usual face. Yeah, I get that a lot as well. Next up, there was a rabbit from the Rabbids games. I'm rabbit. When I make a plan, I always see it through. Yep, even if that plan is to cause absolute chaos. What's up? I always get involved in conversations, no matter what they are about. Bah! And the final islander I decided to admit to live here was Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> yep, because everyone who has to cook has to cook like you. So, what's up? Don't put off until tomorrow what you can do today. Yep. So, where's the lamb sauce? I'm going to make something really nice. I hope so, Gordon. This is gonna be so juicy and tasty. Mm hmm. I hope so. What is it? Ooh, a smoothie. Upon Gordon's arrival, the number of islanders now totaled 40, and I was beginning to run out of space. And so, for now, I thought this was plenty. The situation had become clear to me as Mouse eventually gave birth. I don't mind which. Um... Does the baby look the way you expected? No, absolutely not. <laughs> we thought of a name together, and it's... Kayla. Kayla. Uh, yeah, that's great. What kind of personality do you want the baby to have? 
Uh, once again, leave it to nature. An energetic buddy. Little Kayla. Alongside Kayla, I was also introduced to Goldfish and Pink Panther's hybrid baby. The Goldfish Panther Cub. This time. Wow. <laughs> Surprisingly, that's the most normal looking baby we've seen so far. And that's saying a lot. We thought of a name together, and it's Sunny. Sunny? Hmm. I like it. What kind of personality do you want the baby to have? Uh, once again, leave it to nature. Hmm, an energetic charmer. Nice. There we are. And on February 15th, a particular day had arrived. Although I don't celebrate it, the day was Carnival, and it was on that day that I was introduced to that fabulous feather dancer, Pave the Peacock. Although I know little to nothing about Festival, or Mardi Gras, or whatever this holiday is, I still got into the spirit of things, and everyone began to dance. Pave was quite a good instructor, even though he partly took the spotlight that day. It was a great week. Everyone was happy. Although, despite three new babies on the islands, out of Lauren, Kayla, and Sunny, sadly, whether we like it or not, one of them has to go.